personal. Why? Business. Personal. Personal business. I got coffee down here. That's why I flew all the way down here to get coffee. Let me start over again. I'm in Louisiana. And um, you know what? I'm here for a project, something really cool. And I'm gonna have someone who's better at explaining things. Explain it to y'all. Her name's Rachel. I'll show her, okay? Um, I'm also gonna show you my digs, where I'm staying, a little bit of the, little bit of the town. I'm super excited to be down here. I haven't traveled in a long time. And we're doing some cool stuff. So I'm gonna let her explain it, and I'm just gonna show you around. <laughs> Before I do the tour, I'm staying at my new friend Jeremy's house. He's nice enough to let me stay here. So nice. I love you know that show room raiders where people would go in and raid your room and kind of see what you've been doing i love going into other people's houses and just like seeing how they live and how they do their setup and all the little like nooks and crannies because you know i live with my parents so i like to explore other people's housing let's take a tour first we got a front door peephole nice this pink light the light bulb is white but the light is pink that's super cool do do these couches not remind you of like a 90s sitcom, like Full House. He's got a record player, don't know how to use that. He's got a TV. Uh, Mumford and Sons, Lennon, Bob Dylan, Journey. Okay, Jeremy. Hank Williams. Got a salt lamp, that's nice, a salt lamp. This whole space over here, it's a nice open space. He's an actor, so he has like the backdrop and the lights and the whole, the whole get up and the setup. He's got a little porch out here. This just says fire alarm and test. I don't think I'm going to be testing the fire alarm. I'll leave that to somebody else. It's really not my schedule of things to do. This is the intercom button. I don't know. I did not go through the front door. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a local. So I went to the back. His little kitchen. Got the, oh, is that a blender? Oh, wait, is it a smoothie maker? What the heck? This is, I've never seen one of these. It's like a blender, but you can, a little pour spot for like smoothies or like cocktails. That's awesome. Milk is mine. The two cans are mine. The jelly's mine. Fruit's mine. He eats a lot of cheese and eggs, I'm guessing. <laughs> he has amazing natural sunlight over here. He can do all these activities. I would do my videos right here with the natural sun. I would put like an air mattress out here. I don't know what I would do with this space. Maybe like a huge puzzle. I don't know. So much space. Then you come in here. It's got this big, this big bedroom. Okay. He's got a ping pong table in his bedroom. I know John. She could definitely put it out, put it out there. He also has this really cool, he said his grandpa made this like wood carving. Look at the detail on that. Look at even the feathers on the back such a beautiful piece my grandpa did woodworking like that so i really appreciate this i always wanted to walk in closet a little shoe rack wait is this what smells so good something in this apartment smells so good something in this bathroom smells so good i don't i don't know what it is it's not the soap there's a bar of soap in there it's not that it smells like a guy but also just smells like clean i mean I can't, I can't enough. I'm gonna have to ask him. <laughs> Why does your bathroom smell like that? And here we got the bathroom. He's got like a little rain shower. Very nice bathroom. Love that. We got a little, got a little vanity. Guys, all this little stuff right here. A scale. I will not be stepping on that. Um, <laughs> it's a good place to stay. So I'm glad I could show it to you guys. I hope Jeremy's okay with it. Um, but now that, now YouTube's gonna see it. Well, now that I've showed you around, let's go explore. New Orleans. You know what? They keep telling me that I I keep saying New Orleans because I'm from Chicago. Like I I want to pronounce every vowel. New Orleans, and they it's New Orleans. New Orleans. Okay, let's go. Let's go look at it. Rachel and we are at um, Cafe Dumont in New Orleans. We just ate beignets mm -hmm. and what kind of coffee is this? This is uh, Cafe Au Lait. Very good. Like Frozen the, Cafe Au Lait. The it's sweetness of the, the, be the beignet. Am I saying it wrong? Beignet? 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 No, okay. Mm -hmm. Mixed with this. So good. Okay. So this is Rachel and she'll explain who she is. <laughs> Hey y'all, I am Rachel. I am the director of programming at Company Film NOLA and a filmmaker. Yeah, it's like a nonprofit um, indie 
producing organization, if you will. All encompassing. They yeah, all enco yeah, yeah. And the idea is to work with filmmakers, writers, actors, whoever, whatever, whoever you are and whatever you want to do in the industry to help you sort of like take that next step, whatever it is, however we can help. Yeah. So I reached out to you, what, like, it feels like a year ago now, you, but it was like eight cold, months ago. Cold emailed me cold like eight emailed. months ago. Yeah. I said, who is, I was at New Orleans, who's Rachel? Yeah. Let me know more. So we jumped, popped on a Zoom call. Yeah. And then you presented me with the project, which is why I'm down here, number one reason, yes. and to visit. But do you want to explain like what we're doing? Yeah. So, well, the project has kind of morphed, right? Several times yeah, oh because yeah. of the pandemic and all of that, and needing to be safe and just needing to make things work. So we had several things in the works that we wanted, you know, to bring Christine down for. But at the end of the day, what's happening is we are making her first comedy short film that she has written, <laughs> and it's really funny. And so we've been filmed yet. Yeah, we're That's gonna we, tomorrow. We shoot tomorrow. We rehearse tonight. We shoot tomorrow. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Um, so yeah, we can't wait for y'all to see it. It's gonna be yeah. a blast. Or keep it hush hush. It's about. It has to do with like some businessy board meetings, right. a little bit of skydive, you know, yeah. whatever. Yeah. <laughs> you'll have to, you'll have to watch it. Peanuts. Yeah. Peanuts. Peanuts. This is yeah. all just a little teaser for it. Yeah. But we're filming that today. We're sightseeing. We might do something crazy on Sunday. Fingers crossed. If we can, if we can do it, we'll figure it out later. But um, yeah, we're just hanging out. I'm so excited to be down here. I can't believe we're like listening to jazz music. I'm getting coffee. I'm hanging out. This is amazing, and it's been a long time in the in the work. So we're gonna. I'm just gonna be showing you guys clips from us walking around today because there's it's so much to see. There's, there's so yeah. much to see. It's so beautiful. Mm -hmm. All right. Bye. <laughs> Connection. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this bridge is the Crescent City Connection, according to my tour guide. And this is the Mississippi River, which I don't think I've ever been on. I can't, I don't like nobody's water, but this is really cool. And this is way wider than I thought. Wait, what are those? That is uh, some battleships and a cargo ship coming through. Which, how deep is this? 200 feet. At the deepest. Yeah. That's you cannot That's, swim across I was just going to ask, could you yeah. swim? You will die. Okay, how do we say it? Char 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 chartress. No, hold on. Chair, chair, chair trust? The locals say chartas, whether or not that's chartas? correct. Okay. Is uh, another story. <laughs> chartas. Okay. Chartas. What's the top one? Oh, that's street. It's street oh. Yeah, street in French. And all of a sudden, all the women in the room, they're like, the ch my chest started hurting. I felt like an elephant was stepping on my chest. It felt weird. But at the same moment, all the dudes were like, what is going on? And we were like, oh, oh my god. And the second I left the room, it stopped. It was so weird. I was like, bye. No, I don't think so. Yeah. But I get the food. <laughs> this is the French market. So it's basically a lot of local uh, artists and vendors and small businesses come and set up their wares. So it's like a sort of interesting type of flea market. with a hot dog with like something else. It's good. No, what that is a little spicy too. Cheers. Cheers. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. 
experience of New Orleans been so far? It's good. It's definitely out of my comfort zone, like been in a good way to be like, I'm just seeing so many new things I've never seen before. But I'm just like trying to soak it in. I'm eating the food, I'm hanging out with you, like the ultimate local. Rachel's the ultimate tour guide. <laughs> I mean, the music's good, the vibe's good, the buildings are so cool to look at. Dude, I mean, I couldn't ask for more. This is so, so nice. Oh. the flash is on. I don't know. <laughs> it's all good. We're headed up to the ninth floor of our location where we are going to have a production meeting and table read. Hell yeah. Woo! Okay, we've been bouncing all over the place, but we just did the basically pre-production day before script run through you know, practicing lines, trying to figure out the vibe. It's a whole thing. We are at um, the Win Dixie, which is like a like a grocery store, like local, and she's picking up peanuts. Peanuts are essential to this short film. So she's picking up peanuts, and tomorrow is the shoot day. Yeah. 